Hi guys, uh, today I want to quickly show you how to connect to your Binance Smart Chain into your Metamask, okay? If you do not already have a Metamask account, uh, you should go to metamask.io and you download, okay? You download a Metamask wallet, set up your wallet and make sure that you save your security phrase so that you can always uh, have it in your Chrome extension, like, like what you have here, you have um, my Metamask. This is going to help us to connect Smart Chain and then we shall be able to add any tokens that we want, Smart Chain token, all right? Like Farmware, which in my next video, I'll be showing you how to include the uh, Farmware token into your Metamask. So the first thing you want to do is to, first of all, make sure that you have your uh, Metamax connected into Smart Chain, right? So, um, in order for you to do that, if you already have a Metamax account, you just click here like this, okay? Um, when you have this open, okay? So, this is I already have an account, so I might want to expand uh, the view so that uh, it can be, um, you can see that very well, okay? So, um, the next thing you want to do is to go to academy.binance.com, okay? When you go to academy.binance.com, you want to uh, find out this article that says that connecting uh, Binance, all right? So you have to get some information here and um, go back here. So I'll go back to my Binance account, all right? When I go to my Binance account, the network, uh, you see that uh, I'm on an Ethereum network. So I'll click here and you'll find something here like add network. So click on add network. In some other areas, you see something like networks. Uh, you have to click here like this and then you find something here like add a network, all right? So let's say when you click here, add a network, and then you have, uh, you need to include a network name, all right? So I go to my academy, um, uh, academy.binance.com. The network name is uh, Smart Chain. So I'm going to copy this. All right, so copy this and I'll come here and I'll put the network name and I'll go back, all right? I'll go back, um, new RPC URL. So I'm going to copy this, copy all of this, um, go back here. Um, new RPC, just include that. And then we also have the uh, chain ID. So I'll come back here and I'll see the chain ID is 56, all right? Chain ID is 56, so I'm gonna put um, 56 here. That's the chain ID. And um, currency symbol, all right, currency symbol. Let's see here if uh, we have the currency symbol. Uh, symbol is BNB, okay? Symbol is BNB and uh, here we are, come back here, and I'll put um, the symbol is BNB, okay? And they're asking for block explorer URL, block explorer URL, block explorer URL. So I'm gonna copy this, okay? I'm gonna copy this here. And then I will come here and I'll submit that. Okay guys, so I'm just adding, then I'll click on save, right? And click on save. Okay, so guys, we just added the smart chain into our Metamask. Okay, so you see that the network here is uh, smart chain BNB. All right, you find here the network is smart chain. If you want to go, you can always switch from smart chain to the Ethereum. All right, uh, Ethereum network. This is where we were. All right, we this is where we started. All right, I can always switch uh, network. Okay, so I'm on smart chain network, and this is where I am. All right, you can see smart chain BNB. So you can now. Uh, buy, you can receive, you can send, BNB, all right? So guys, uh, this is a quick video to show you how to add a smart chain, all right, into your Metamask. So in my next video now, I'm now going to show you how to include uh, tokens, which one of the tokens that we shall be using for those of you uh, in the Kringo, private Kringo Society, I'll be showing you how to add firmware in our next video. Okay, guys? Until then, please do not forget to like, subscribe my page, and see you in my next video. Bye-bye.